Hello my dear student. Welcome back to my class, the class of happy learning. Today I will talk about the structure of paragraph and the process of how to write a paragraph in the best possible way. So first of all, we need to know the structure of a paragraph. The basic structure of a paragraph is very easy. An ideal paragraph should have four parts. The first one is called the topic sentence. The topic sentence means what is the topic of your paragraph. So from the very first line, we should understand that what your paragraph is all about. If your paragraph is about the population problem of Bangladesh, then your first topic sentence will be Bangladesh is a highly populated country. Or if your topic is the agriculture of our country, then your topic sentence should be Bangladesh is an agricultural country or something like that. So from the very first sentence, we should understand that what is the topic of your paragraph. If we can understand that, then your topic sentence is a correct one. So the first sentence is basically the topic sentence. The second part of your paragraph should be the main body part. This is the main body of a paragraph. In the body part, you will try to give all kind of information, all kind of arguments, all kind of opinion, all kind of examples, all kind of stories, quotations, and other things that will prove your main topic of the paragraph. The next part is called the context modulators. That means sometimes we need to write something which comes naturally with the context. Think that we are talking about the uh, Ekushe book fair. That is our main topic. But contextually, we can also write about the other book fairs that happens in Bangladesh, like the Dhaka book fair or the other literary book fairs or something else. So which are related to the main topic and which are contextual that we can write in this part. The last part of your paragraph is basically called the terminatory sentence. That means the final line of your paragraph where you will finish your paragraph with some good notions. Like think that we are writing a paragraph on the beauty of Bangladesh. So our terminator sentence could be Bangladesh is such a beautiful country and I am so happy to be a part of this beautiful country. So my dear student, these are the parts of an ideal paragraph. If you can follow all these steps, if you can follow all the structure for writing a paragraph, you will be able to write a very good paragraph which will please your teacher and the other people who will read your paragraphs. So I hope that you have understood it clearly. If you have any question, there will be live session and you can ask me any kind of question there. So don't worry. Have a beautiful day. Have a nice day. Thank you very much. See you again.